forgive you of your sins. Father, forgive me for I have committed sins against you. Forgive me. And I'm asking you, oh, that you would prove to me that what uh, Pastor Morris is saying is absolute truth. I'm asking you, come into my heart and, and, and live in me. I want to make you my Lord. I want to submit to Holy Spirit. I want the life that Pastor Morris is talking about. And I realize that only you can give it to me. So give it to him, Jesus. Give him your truth. I know you prayed that with me, <laughs> and I celebrate you, but it's one thing for me to celebrate you. I want you to understand all of glory, all of heaven is celebrating you today. Oh, precious one, thank you. Thank you for making such a bold decision. We celebrate you, and we thank God for you. Now, precious ones, remember the sacrifice that Jesus bore and went through, he went through a night of living hell. And he did that, being brutalized. The, 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 his beard ripped from his face, spit upon. The stripes that he bore on his back, being whipped with a cat of nine tails, is ripped off his back. He did it for you. And this is why. Thank you, Jesus, for your uh, precious, precious sacrifice. I'm, I'm running out of time, so let me accelerate. This blood represents his righteousness. Thank you, Jesus. We bless you, and we give you honor, praise, and glory for your righteousness. Whoa, thank you. Saints, hey, <laughs> this has been your mentoring moment. I'm Pastor Morris. I'm honored to be here with you today. I look forward to seeing you the next time. Go forth today. Expect signs and wonders to follow you. Why? Because you are a believer. Bless you now.